I'm here for the sunshine and the nice skiing. But uh, we think uh, some projects for the Granada 2015 Winter Universiade. Well, of course, we held the World Championships for Alpine skiing in 1995-96 uh, in is how I always say it. Um, and uh, so we have uh, the basic uh, materials for, uh, for skiing. But what we don't have is the other uh, sports for the Winter Universiade. And, uh, and uh, we also think that Granada is uh, one of top two or three cities for the universities in all of Spain. So I think the, the sport for university students here adds, adds some new uh, sports facilities and brings uh, the world together, I think more than 40 countries uh, in 2015 to make a sports competition. Oh, I'm, no, not yet. It's just an early start. We don't have a program yet, uh, actually. I'm sorry. <laughs> we have five years. <laughs> Cinco años. Yes, uh, I mean, that's, uh, that's really almost a key point. We, we built a very nice new village in Prado de Andalucía, Prado Llano, for the World Championships Alpine Ski. But still, it's, the whole urbanization is not working in the traffic and transportation and parking. It's not working optimal. When we have to host a world event like uh, Universiade, it gives us a chance to make another look at the habits of the people and some policies and maybe some staffing or management ideas and maybe some infrastructure as well to try to make the resort growing better. And this is typical for Olympic Games like we have in, in Whistler right now, it's typical for uh, World Championships, it's typical for Universiade that you try to leave a legacy of uh, nice improvements in the infrastructure. Yeah, absolutely. The yeah, first one comes to mind is uh, Valle Nevado in El Colorado, La Parva in, uh, in, Ch in Chile, you know. I mean, uh, coming from the sea and the river and or maybe it's the Spanish feeling or uh, and they have, uh, they need very much uh, access improvements. But I think when we speak about to look at uh, benchmarking, I think Whistler is going to be a very good example of how we we built a good station, ski racing was a long history ski racing. And then we kept upgrading the level, the urbanism, the village, and now we have Olympic Games, we have a new highway, we have much better communications, uh, fiber optic and uh, in the sky. So that's, uh, I think the team is going to visit the Olympics and uh, some members of our team here will visit and we're going to spend a week together looking at all the best examples, the latest, most modern examples for uh, hosting a world-class event.